Hello everyone. Thank you for being here this morning. We're going to have the IDs webinar in a couple of minutes. Let's just check first on the audio. And we're going to be using the question panel on the right side of your screen. So please use this panel to let us know if the audio is loud and clear, if you can hear us correctly. And we'll be using this question panel throughout the webinar to answer all of your questions. So let's first uh, check if you can listen this correctly. So on the right side of your screen, you have a questions panel. And there you can let us know. Mr. Jason, thank you so much. So throughout the webinar, if you have any question or comment about the products uh, that Larry will be presenting to us, please just send us a quick uh, question or message. And at the end of the webinar, we're going to have a Q&A panel and we'll be answering all of your questions. And also a quick reminder that this webinar will be recorded and sent to your email right after the webinar. We are also uploading all of your all of our webinars to our YouTube channel, Epcom USA, where you can check all of our webinars. If you want to review the information or you have questions, you can go to Epcom USA on YouTube and you can always check all of our webinars. Also, a reminder that any of the products that you see on the presentation, uh, we can uh, quote it to you or send it directly if we have them on stock. So please ask your sales representative for a quote of any of these products and we'll be happy to help you at Epcom. So I think now, Larry, we're gonna be ready. So thank you, thank you everyone for being here this morning. We're gonna start with our IDs webinar. So Larry it will be our presenter directly from IDIS and he will be our presenter for today's webinars. Larry, good morning. All right, good morning, guys. So now we are ready, Larry. Thank you so much for being here and now you can start. All righty. I'm not gonna take up a whole lot of your you guys' time, you know, maybe the next three hours or so. Just kidding, guys. I'm not gonna take that much of your time. We're gonna go through this pretty quick. Um, if you're not familiar with IDIS, IDIS has been around for, for the past 25 years. Uh, originally, IDIS started out as OEM. We OEMed uh, products like uh, Bosch, Honeywell, uh, ADI. We did all their, their OEM uh, cameras. So a lot of you may be already familiar with the IDIS cameras from back in the day. Um, sorry. Um, they decided to get out of the OEM. We still have a few uh, out there that we OEM for. Um, but for the most part, everything we do is direct, like through Epcom or, or direct from, from us. You guys will be buying everything through, through Epcom. Uh, we're a one solution, one company. We manufacture everything end to end. All our cameras, NVR switches, monitors, accessories, our AI stuff and the sporting software. Uh, and as you can see, everything is NDAA uh, compliant. We still have a few cameras out there that we're towards the end of that aren't, but every, everything new is all NDAA now. Um, these are just some of the companies that uh, fall under IDIS Holdings. IDIS, Cortex, IDP, I don't know if you can see this other one here, Vixelon, and the other one that will uh, uh, fall under that now is uh, uh, Postar, will fall under IDIS Holdings. Not sure exactly where it's going to go yet, to be honest with you. Uh, they're still figuring all that out. So, when I know, you guys will know. These are just some of the places that IDIS is presently at. You see IDIS America here. We're right here in Capel. Our actual headquarters is, is here in uh, in Korea. Just a few of our sales, just real quick. These are 
from 21, so they're a bit older, uh, 157 million. Uh, we employ over 600 now uh, people. Again, and we're in we're in Korea, uh, U.S., U.K., and, and uh, U.A.E. We're the largest video surveillance manufacturer in Korea. They're in rank 13 globally. It's about uh, three and a half million units now, and over 20 uh, million cameras out there. These are just a few that we, our places, uh, our headquarters in in Korea. Our mayor, our one, where I'm at right now is in Capel. We have uh, NVRs from four channels, all the way to six four channels, full feature recording, uh, IDA Center, our own VMS uh, software. Let me move this and you'll have to see that hopefully. Up to 1,024 devices. And when you go to the NVR and go to uh, ISS, we can connect 65,000 cameras running on our free software. Our VMS software uh, is always in the background. And there again, there's no cost for it. You're not going to pay an annual fee like you do on some of the larger larger systems. Uh, pay annually. What you pay up front is a one time and that's it. Our NVRs and DVRs and uh, for seven years for all our partners, five years on the cameras. And again, we, we manufacture and produce everything uh, that you see. Direct IP, video solution, auto configure IP cameras, NVR is a network device, seamless. You plug in, it's going to go find uh, bin network for every network. Uh, allows us to uh, record other cameras, the on BIF cameras. Not too many cameras that uh, we can't uh, record off our NVRs. Um, we have the mission critical failure, failover, I'm sorry, redundancy for the power, memory, and restoral. I, all IDS, IDIS technology again, micro, uh, plug and play direct, or ESATA drives in RAID 1, 5, 6, and 10, uh, up to 240 terabytes. This is a sample of one of our. Uh, PTZs is 36 times. We have this one and we have another one that's uh, outdoor that has actually has a windshield wiper over it. Uh, benefits increase the profits and reduce costs, direct IP. Uh, our own auto encryption, our auto configurations. And, redu and reducing the hours that it takes you to uh, enroll them. You, you don't have to put the IP addresses in. It's automatically configured for you. Once you put it in, you just drag it, put it in there. Same way with uh, mapping. If you have a map, you can put a map in there and you can take the cameras and you can take them like and just drag them, put them in wherever you want to put them, put them in the door, put them in a the hallway, put them wherever you want to put them. Seamless, direct IP is seamless uh, across all the hardware, software, and accessories. Forward, backward compatible, like I said, customer satisfaction increases uh, opportunities. Uh, less time of identifying uh, critical issues. They're all right there. They're running on the site. Anytime you want to find them, you can click on them or you can come down and find them like you normally do. Uh, with movement through the uh, cameras.
this is our fisheye camera. This is one of our bread and butter cameras. Uh, it truly dewarps. I don't know if you're familiar with it, but I, I will show you how it, they truly dewarp. And you can get seven images out of one camera. And each one is independent. It's all built in cybersecurity, which is all encrypted. It's our own encryptions. Nobody else is going to have it. It's strictly ours. It totally authenticates uh, the cameras, the recording, the storage, everything. That's just a quick, quick overview of who Lightus is. Uh, Well, I got to try to figure out how to get out of here. Hello, Larry. Let's jump here real quick. Go ahead. No, no, go ahead. Yeah, perfect. Now you can switch. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I just quick go here. These are just some of the buildings we have now with Watermark Church, uh, Capel ISD right here in, in Capel, uh, AT and T Stadium. Our cameras in there and all of uh, Amerisource Bourbon, which is a pharmaceutical company, is some just some of the larger larger ones we have. I just want to show you that real quick. Get out of that and this. I'm gonna go into our, our IDIS center where we have a lot of our cameras. It's they're all live cameras. Take it a few minutes to come up. As you can see, these cameras are all live here. Um, our warehouse. These are fish eyes. I'll go into a little bit. To the right, you can see where it says device group, all devices. Here's our demo, 8364, 2516, and 6532. Each one of these, you can just simply drag into here, take it and drag it in. It'll populate the cameras. This particular one's our uh, IDLA. These have a lot of the analytics in them. We'll go over that. You can see it's marking the cars here. So I'll go back to this one real quick and show you. This is our demo room. This is where we do all our technical training. And you can see we have a, a large demo wall here that we bring everything up on. There's a lot of cameras in here that you can actually play with. You can see there's cameras on the table. It's a true hands-on learning. If you ever want to send any anybody here, um, June, I believe 12th through the 14th is our next training here in Cabell. So if you have anybody you want to send here, let me know, let Miguel or April know, somebody there at Epcom, let us know and we'll uh, get you on the list and get you in here to get trained. It's not a sales training, it's a, it is a technical training. But this is a mini bullet in there. And I'll show you the PTZ, this is a PTZ, I mean, a, uh, sorry, a fish eye. And as you can see, here's the seven panes that I was talking about. And you can move them all independently as you, as you wish. The fisheye itself, 
it completely dewarps. If you have a line and you want to watch that line running across, you can watch the line. If you want to watch these here, you can come over and watch these and you can move it back and forth. If you want to watch the back door, you can watch the back door. If you want to watch the side door, you can watch the side door. Anything along the wall, anything anywhere else in there that you want to watch. Maybe it's the other door over here you want to watch. Each one is off of one camera. This one happens to be up in the ceiling. And like I said, you could move it. Zoom it in. And while you're watching this door, you can come over and watch this production line, what they're putting in. You can actually zoom into it. Everything was, is with a mouse and the wheel. Not going to be anybody in there right now. <laughs> This is our back parking lot. This is just an eight megapixel bullet camera. You can go all the way across the parking lot if you'd like. As you can see this camera right here, this is one of the ones that has our analytics in it. It's counting people as they come in and out. Helps. You can do it however you want. You can set it up how you want. You can you can count them coming in, you can count them coming out. You can zoom in to see who they are. But this is our front door. We're just, we've got a line right here. You can put the line anywhere you want. See how many people come in, how many people come out. Use it in retail a lot, seeing how many people either come in the door or come out or go down a particular aisle. They use it in various ways. And this is just a fish eye out, out in front. This is just set up with the three panes. You can set it up at everyone, set it up with as many as you'd like. And you have multiple views.
be in our warehouse, our front door, the outside. <clears throat> This is just a front, <clears throat> excuse me, PTZ. It's a two megapixel. Or a two megapixel has a pretty good view. And these are all live. Here you will always have, see. Go oh ahead. No, well, we have a quick question from Jason, and he's asking us if yeah. there some type of facial recognition with the in and out feature. Yes, you could have facial recognition. We don't have it set up yet, unless they just recently did it. This was just identifying cars. If a bike went by, it would identify a bike. Or if a person walked by, it would identify a person. Our facial recognition. The actual software is through a third party because it's so massive, identifying people, someone you don't want in the building or a criminal, they'll identify them, put the block on them and sound an alarm. And, and I'll show you kind of how that works in here in a second. That's it. They really have any of the other setup here. But it has the line crossing that the like I said, the counting, the facial, um trip and falls. It's all in the in our analytics. Um if you have a system that's out there right now. It doesn't have it. We have a, uh, a box that's called a 1304. You can put that box alongside the uh, NVR and say you got four main cameras that you want to look at and you want the analytics on them, front door, people coming in, people loitering, people in certain aisles or people in certain areas that are supposed to be sound alarm. You can take those four cameras, put it into the box, put it right from that box right into your NVR and you have all the analytics on those four cameras. Rather than having to change the whole system out. I'll show you real quick. I will show you. Just a little quick video, hope it'll come up. It shows uh, it's like a missing person. That's identifying the person has a has a green shirt on. 
So they're going to go find everybody that has a green shirt on and find the one person that matches it. And then they'll show everywhere he's been. Just a quick, uh, match showing <clears throat> everywhere that particular person has been. This is the one showing object detection.
Any questions on any of that? I mean, how are we doing this? Are we taking questions? Uh... Hello, Larry. Well, at the moment, we have another question from Mr. Peter. How do you do your analytics by software or by hardware? Software. All through our own software. Thank you, Larry. And I think this is a good uh, moment for all of you. Please send us all of your questions. Uh, we're about to end the webinar. And if you have any questions, please let us know. Larry from IDIS will be directly answering all of your questions. So please, this is the time for you to send us your comments. And also, a quick reminder that all of the cameras that you're seeing, the 2 megapixel, the 8 megapixel, the fisheye, and PTC, uh, we can quote them directly to you. So please send a message to your sales representative, and he or she will be help, happy to help you with, with a quote. So we don't have any other question, Larry. I don't know if you want to add anything else. Well, again, if, you know, if anybody needs any technical training, uh, it's coming up. Or if you need, you know, other training, I, you know, I'll gladly come out. Uh, I know uh, you guys will come out as well. Uh, sales guys, April, Miguel, whoever. But if you need me to come out, I'll gladly come out and go over everything with your team. Thank you, Larry. And IDIS at the moment, it's in Texas. And we're also in Texas, in El Paso and San Antonio. So if you are uh, in the U.S., please send us a message. We can also deliver directly from Miami. And, well, we'll be sharing the dates for the upcoming training in June. You mentioned, Larry, that's correct? Well, to the 14th, yeah. Awesome. Thank you. So we'll be sharing that here information here with you. Capel. I'm sorry? Here in Capel. In Capel. Awesome. And that's uh, yes. really close to Dallas and forward. Let's say uh, uh, it will be a 40 minute drive around that, Larry. From from where? From Dallas. Uh, from, well, from one airport, it's 30. From DFW, it's like 15. Awesome. Thank you. So if you're interested in our IDIS uh, training directly from Iris, please uh, keep checking your email and we'll be sharing this information with you. So thank you so much for being here this morning. Larry, thank you so much for sharing all this valuable information from Iris. I don't know if you want to add anything else to, uh, to this session. No, you're more than welcome to, uh, to give us a call. Give up, come a call, need anything. Thank you so much, Larry. And we'll be sending the recording of this webinar to your email. So please check, keep checking your email as well as our website, appcom.net, for future webinars on our webinar section. And we'll be happy to see you on our next sessions. So Larry, thank you so much. And thank you, everyone, for your time this morning. We hope to see you again. Goodbye. Thanks, guys.